Dear viewers, greetings. In this present video, we are going to see about acid for staining. The aim of the acid for staining is to differentiate the bacteria into acid fast bacteria, particularly the species of mycobacterium and non acid fast groups. According to the history, the acid for staining is the differential staining technique uh, which was first de developed by Zeil and later on modified by Nielsen. So this method is also called as a Zeil Nielsen staining technique. Uh, Nielsen in 1883 used Zeil's carbol fusing and heat then decolorized with an acid alcohol and counter strain with methylene blue. Thus a Zeil Nielsen staining technique was developed. Uh, principle acid for staining method is used for those microorganisms which are not stained by the simple or gram staining method particularly the members of the genus mycobacterium nocatia and cryptosporidium the presence of a thick wax sieve wall that is the mycolic acid in the mycobacterium species makes penetration by strains extremely difficult once the strain penetrates it cannot be readily removed when the acid alcohol as the decolorizing agent uh, because of this property this organism is called as acid fast and uh, don't use the bacteria uh, which was cultivated on the blood agar for for the acid fast training because the bacteria cultivated on blood agar may experience nutrient deprivation and resulting in a lower lipid content in the outer membrane and resulting in poor staining so uh, they are not recommended for the acid for staining technique. And next, the stains and declarizer used for the acid for staining. The primary stain is carbol fusin, the moderant is steam, and the declarizing agent is acid alcohol. Acid alcohol is prepared by adding 3% uh, hydrochloric acid and 95% ethanol. And finally, the counter strain is methylene blue. And regarding the simple one line principle, and here uh, the acid fast bacilli resist declarization due to the presence of uh, mycolic acid in the uh, cell wall and appears red in color due to the carbol fusing. But the non acid fast bacilli undergoes declarization and takes the counter strain methylene blue and it appears blue in color. Materials required for the acid fast staining are 72 hours culture of mycobacterium species, 24 hours culture of staphylococcus species, Bunsen burner, inoculating loop, glass light, hot plate, microscope, carbol fusing, acid alcohol which was prepared by using 3% hydrochloric acid and 95% ethanol and methylene blue. Next the procedure, uh, clean and dry the microscopic slide thoroughly. Uh, prepare the thin smear of given bacteria on a clean glass light. Allow the smear to air dry and fixed when heat. Uh, flooded the smear with cobalt fusing, uh, heat fixed and allow steam into the hot plate for 3 to 5 minutes. And after that, uh, cool the slide and wash with the tap water and then declarize with acid alcohol by adding reagent drop by drop for 10 to 15 minutes until the carbol fusing fill to wash from the smear with the tap water and counter strain the smear with methylene blue for 2 minutes and then washed with the smear with tap water and finally uh, blot hydrate the smear and observe under the low power objective that is 10x or 40x and high power objective that is 100x oil emission of the microscope and observation and results Acid fast bacilli appears as a bright red to intensive purple. A red stripe or slightly curved rods occur singly or in small groups and may appear beaded. Some examples for the acid fast bacilli are Mycobacterium species, Nocardia species, and Cryptosporidium species. A non acid fast bacilli appears in blue color. In addition, the background material should be stained blue. And this image shows the acid fast and non acid fast bacilli. And here the red colored uh, rod shows the acid fast bacilli, and the 
blue colored cell shows the non acid fast bacilli dear viewers thank you for your support thank you